let's take a journey back in time. I'm sitting here with my college friend, Fred Lassen. Fred, mutton chops, why? You look crazy. I don't know. They just happened one day. I never even saw them. When did you get that? Well, I saw you like a I year ago. I stopped shaving and I just kept them going. But you shaved this. Well, true. I just, but I didn't want to go the whole way up. Girls, are you attracted to this? <laughs> <laughs> get back to me. Anywho, so we're going to go through two moments from our history, our shared history of 42nd Street. The first is uh, Fred was the pianist on Broadway. And <laughs> stop warming up. I don't it's know. It's four just, measures. All right, all right. And um, there's a famous moment, you know, during the 42nd Street dance where um, her lover gets shot, right? Mm -hmm. So this is how it normally would sound in the pit. Hit it. Then you'd hear, bang! All right, so um, there's a lot of pit musician humor, and I'd say 99% of it. Um, it's not up to snuff. Fred, you're obsessed with that oh, wire. 99% of it is not up to snuff. <laughs> However, Fred had his own hilarious pit musician humor. What he would do is, now you would rig this. It was not, it was not a, a wire like this. It was like a very thin thread. Right, it was not a, they didn't have fire wire back then. That's, that's all we had at Downtown Mama. But you had a thread, and now when would you do it? During intermission or right before the number? Oh, uh, sometime right before Cameron the number. Camera uh, Right before the number. He would, he would rig his hat. And by the way, would anyone actually watch you do this bit? Probably. Wait, you yeah, everybody in the pit. I mean, you could see that. Well, you, you, yeah, you get everybody to see it. Okay, because so, so you imagine the whole orchestra and this. This <laughs> I think it's such a hilarious thing to do. So the pit. And it takes so much preparation for a one second joke, but it's so hilarious. Like half a second of. Pleasure. Okay, so this is literally what happened to me in the forty right, second orchestra. Let's see if I can do this. Hit it. Bang! <laughs> Hat flies off. Instant humor. Brilliant. The pit's is, falling all over themselves. It is Crazy squawk on the oboe. <laughs> Blamed on the reed. Oboe players always blame their reed. It's My reed. Them. Really? It's actually a bad technique. Okay, and now the second 42nd Street story, but Fred first has to prepare. Oh. Oh. Fred and I worked in Summerstock, Cannibal Playhouse in the late 80s, and Fred for some reason acquired this. Okay, so first of all, I don't even remember why you had it. Well, I bought it for $50 from this guy at Oberlin. But did we ever use it at Candlewood? No. You just well, maybe we use it for cabaret. Do we do the show cabaret together? No. Oh, I don't know why I had it. I asked the same question. Girls, are you attracted <laughs> to this? <laughs> so just it's a follow up. So I hosted the cabaret at Candlewood, and you know we'd have all these great singers, and I have no idea why Fred and I did this. We, I guess we were doing forty. We were doing forty. Well, you were always practicing your tap combinations at the piano when you were rehearsing. Oh. Yeah, I remember Out, that part. Outed me for being needy. <laughs> okay, keep going. And, but then how do we segue into this? Well, you thought it would be a good idea to do it at the post-show cabaret at the bar. But I decided that you should accompany me on the accordion while well, I did a tap dance. I don't know why that. Maybe, maybe I, I suggested the accordion. Yeah, I, I think, think I might have just suggested I just, that. All I know is that we literally did this in a cabaret act because it was just the most <laughs> awkward. We're obsessed that it begins so awkwardly in the accordion park. Honk, 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 honk. And then terrible tapping. And Fred didn't quite know the right chords. Yeah, well, I didn't know all the chords. And there's it's, one chord in the song that I didn't. He can't really figure out how to play in the accordion. So yeah. like literally wrong chord. The avenue, I'm taking you to. It's just a crazy made up chord. And then it ends in a major chord because he can't quite get a minor yeah, one I out of that. I can't get my finger to the right, the right button. So all in all, it was a terrible act, and we'd like to recreate something for you that brought go. down the house, meaning people left, um, around 20 <laughs> years ago. <clears throat> Are you? By the way, I got these shoes when I did uh, Easter Bonnet competition. Aren't they cool? Wow. They're not even tap shoes, but they look like tap shoes. Oh. They're not tap shoes. That sucks. <laughs> Girls, so are you well. attracted to yeah, this? Right. Anywho, this is from the Candlewood Cabaret, a recreation for you. This is Fred and My History with 42nd Street. It's not 20 years ago. Loving look exchanged <laughs> at the end. <laughs> Gorgeous. Still got, yes, it. got it! <laughs>